channel. I feel like I always come on here looking crazy, looking like somebody grandma. Especially in my older videos, I was on here like this all the time. But I promise, <laughs> this is probably, uh, oh, I'm not even gonna lie like that. This ain't gonna be the last time. But it is what it is. I just woke up, washed my face, brushed my teeth. And now, if you guys cannot tell by the title below, I'm gonna be giving you guys a get ready with me. I have work today, so I'm literally just doing this video just because. By the way, ignore how fat my bonnet is. Okay, I picked up the wrong one. All right. And if you guys see this budge, it's because I have flexi rods in my hair. So bear, bear with me. I decided to do this video because I feel like I haven't done a get ready with me where I just sat down and literally just got ready with you guys in a minute. So we're finna do it now. I feel like I'm always losing my stuff when I'm doing a video. I don't get it. I just, I can't be great. That's why that looked like that. I had my brush flipped upside down. Anyways, how are you guys' morning going, you guys? My morning is going pretty well. I woke up, prayed, brushed my teeth, washed my face. I had a good morning, y'all. But what's going to make or break this morning are... Oop. We're just going to ignore that. Are these flexi rods that are in my hair, you guys? Because I put them in last night. And if you guys know me, my hair is short. I cut it a couple months ago. Well, it's probably been more than a couple months now. But I cut it a while ago. And it's been growing pretty well. And I haven't done a flexi rod set on myself in a minute especially with my hair this short so i'm scared on how it's gonna turn out i don't know hopefully it turns out pretty well i'm debating if i don't show it on camera then you know it didn't come out well because i refuse to come on here looking any kind of way okay i like how i say that while i look like this we're just not gonna talk about it okay stop talking about it I don't know what it is you guys i'm just in a great mood this morning like i'm excited to go to work i only work at this job on the weekends because of school and i get so excited to go and matter of fact i don't even think that i told you guys this y'all i work as a waitress again i'm not going to tell you guys where because people be crazy but i work as a waitress again you guys and i'm loving it i've been working as a waitress since like what june yeah, I think it was June because right before I worked there, I worked at TJ Maxx. I literally stayed at TJ Maxx for a week or two and quit because not because of the people. It was just the job itself. I can't do it. I No, don't get me wrong, you guys. I loved being a like cashier where I ring up people's clothes and stuff but i didn't know that they had to cross train you maybe i didn't read like the description of what i was applying for good enough but i honestly didn't know that they were gonna have to cross train me which means i have to work in the like back department i have to do um like the dressing room all of that so when i did anything that wasn't like cashiering which i did most of the time but once they put me in that dressing room and then i had to stay there all day just standing no even if this was an easy job i'm not doing that i can't <laughs> i need to be moving because standing in one place the whole time no it's there it feels like i was there for hours on hours on hours when really i was only there for probably like six can't do it it wasn't meant for me i gotta be moving gotta be typing gotta be doing some so i quit within a week got hired in my new job which is way just saying i don't know what i'll be thinking but anyways i'm gonna go with my beauty blender and i'll be right back okay all right i'm back you guys, I don't know if I'm just slow or late to the makeup game, but I just now figured out that a wet beauty blender is literally like a game changer. I'm not just saying that. It blends out my concealer so well, you guys. I don't know if you guys can see this, but my concealer is about to look so seamless. It's going to be blended into my skin so well. No pores will be seen. Like, I don't know. I don't know how it does it. I don't know the chemistry behind it, but I know that it works so well. And what's funny is that I tried a wet beauty blender, like that whole trend, before and I didn't like it. I did it like a year or two ago and I didn't like it. I felt like it picked up most of the product, but I don't know. It's been working lately. Look at the pan. <laughs> My contour is halfway gone. I guess I have to use another color too. I don't even use a lot. I just do it to like darken up around where I just put that concealer. Okay, she's coming together. I'm starting to look like I'm actually awake. So let's go ahead and do powder. I think powder is one of my favorite steps in doing my makeup. It's just so relaxing. And like, I'm able to create that sharp line. Like, I love it. I don't know what it is, but I love it so much. It just, it brings it all together. All right, now we're gonna finish this look off with mascara. I love the Voluminous Mascara by L'Oreal Paris. One of my favorites, you can get it from Walmart. Second favorite is the Clinique Mascara. You might be able to find this at Walmart. I'm not sure, but I got it from the cosmetic store. I love the formula of this mascara, you guys. It's like a wet mascara. I love it, I don't know what it is. I'm debating whether I wanna go ahead and put my clothes on or take out these flexi rods. 
I think I'm gonna just take out the flex yards first and I'll be right back. If they look good, then I might film it. If they don't, you know what happened. Okay, hold on. Yes, I look like somebody's grandmother. But who's to say their grandmother looks bad? This is what my flexi bra set is looking like, you guys. Um, I went ahead and changed my shirt. This isn't my work shirt, but my work shirt has my logo. And I was like, that's a no-go. So I'm going to just take down a couple with you guys to see what this is looking like. When I tell you guys I haven't done a flexi bra set in so long. Okay, that's not ugly, but it needs to stop sticking out like that. I'm going to put some oil on my hand. This is a mixture of oils that I threw in this, but this is one of my favorite oils. So go ahead and use that, but... I'm going to just go ahead and use this to kind of unravel them a little. Not a whole lot, but just a little bit. And if you guys don't know, you guys, the oil is to reduce the frizz when you take it out and when you try to like comb it a little bit with your hands. Just in case you guys are wondering why I'm using oil, that's why. Oh, look, that one's a perfect one. guys the results are giving my hair came out good i'm so happy that it did i was scared because i have tried this flexi rod set on my hair ever since i've cut it for the longest and it never worked out but it finally looks good i'm so happy about it i went ahead and asked my mom to make sure it looked good because y'all know your mom's not gonna lie to you at least i hope not because my mom gonna tell me but anyways that's neither here nor there y'all i'm so happy with the way it came out i went ahead and put some bobby pins on the top because i wanted these two curls to be over here like i wanted a side part it was what I was going for. I also put a bobby pin up here because I want this to kind of swoop a little bit. Y'all, the curls are giving. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's cute. Okay, you guys, so your girl is dressed and ready to serve. Look at the glasses, you guys. I just got these off of Vuglam with my other pair. And you guys, I love them. It's just something about big glasses and a short hairstyle. It's cute. But anyways, I was supposed to come on here and show you guys the jewelry. So this necklace I just bought from Forever 21. It's super cute. It's a two-piece. And then I got these rings from there for a dollar. They were on clearance. Then I have on my Apple Watch. Um, I was gonna put on a bracelet, but I don't feel like it. Y'all, I almost forgot to show you guys my earrings as well. I got these earrings from a new jewelry store in my mall. I'm gonna show you guys. The brand is called Lovisa, I think. I'm not sure of the name, but they have tons of affordable jewelry on there and I love their jewelry store, so I would definitely go check them out. But you guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end off today's video. I have to head to work and I got some errands to run before I do. So if you guys enjoyed today's video, you guys already know what to do. Like, comment, and subscribe, follow me on all of my social media in the description box below. And don't forget to turn on that post notification bell so that you guys can be updated every time I upload. And you guys already know, I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys!